欢迎收睇美国针对就嘅美国专讯，我系任敬阳。德克萨斯州系美国保守派嘅大本营，呢、这个就系点解一名女同性恋者喺二零一零年赢得休士顿市市长选举之后，轰动整个美国嘅原因。喺佢当选一周年之后接受咗我哋嘅记者徐崇伟嘅专访，将谈佢嘅人生旅程同从政经历。有住二百二十万人口嘅休士顿系全美第四大城市。佢唔单止系美国石油业嘅大本营，更加系发展航空工程、太阳能等新兴科技嘅工业重镇。喺政治同社会议题上，当地系一个保守嘅城市。呢、这个就系点解喺二零零九年，当一名公开嘅女同性恋市议员宣布参选市长时，令到好多人跌破眼镜。Clearly, there are people who, in the city who perceive my sexual orientation as a negative. 二零一零年一月。安尼斯帕克同休斯顿缔造咗历史性嘅一刻。呢一名曾经担任电脑工程师同市议员嘅公开女同志，成为美国历史上第一个大城市女同性恋市长。同性恋喺美国政界至今仍然系弱势族群。喺国会四百三十五名众议员中，只有四名系公开嘅同性恋者。喺二零零四年，当时已婚嘅新泽西州州长，仲因为暴露同志身份被逼下台。帕克喺政界风气对同性恋不利嘅情况下，赢得市长一职，主要系因为佢丰富嘅从政经验同地方选举嘅独特性。Have to pick up the trash. There has to be water. There has to be some uh, uh, sewer system. You have to repair the roads. They don't care what your party affiliation is. They really don't care、uh, about the how you feel about national issues, but issues like.、Uh, Uh, abortion or immigration policy or、uh, gay marriage, all of those things. Voters are smart enough to know that I have opinions, and when asked, I share those opinions. But in my campaigns, I don't talk about those opinions because those aren't relevant to what I do as mayor. 喺当选市长后，帕克将平衡预算、缩减政府开支当做首要任务。佢并且计划将休士顿建造成一个绿色之都。同文化旅游重镇，呢啲政策为佢赢得选民嘅肯定但系佢嘅身份继续引起争论。喺竞选过程中，佢嘅性取向一度受到对手同宗教团体强烈嘅抨击。而一啲唔愿意接受记者正式采访嘅民众，亦私下表示对同性恋负面嘅睇法。帕克对呢一种反同性恋嘅情绪并唔陌生，从细就因为自己嘅性取向受到排挤。帕克学会权益系要靠自己争取得嚟嘅。喺大学毕业后，年轻嘅帕克投入人权运动，成为德州曝光率最高嘅同性恋维权人士之一。喺当时，同性恋者喺美国仲受到好多迫害，佢本人亦受到多次嘅死亡威胁。The early e i s in the 1980s, you could still be sent to a mental institution. For, for being gay,、uh, it was still a criminal offense uh, to uh, engage in any kind of sexual activity with someone of the same gender. 虽然今日嘅美国已经唔系三十多年前嘅美国，同性恋权益亦受到好多法律上嘅保障。不过近几年嚟，美国有关同性婚姻嘅争论成为堕胎问题之外另外一个分裂社会嘅议题。喺呢个议题上，帕克有住切身嘅感受。If you have a conversation with people about, do you believe in、uh, that gay people ought to be able to have legal protections for their relationships? That gay people ought to be able to visit each other in the hospital to make legal decisions for each other? People say, "Oh yeah," but then you, if you call that a civil union, they have one opinion. If you call that very same relationship a civil marriage, they have a different opinion. And if you call it full marriage, They go nuts. 
二零零四年，美国麻省同加州率先为同性伴侣颁发结婚证书，引起极大嘅争议，亦令到同性关系合法化成为二零零四年总统大选中一个举足轻重嘅关键议题。支持者认为同性伴侣应该受到同婚姻类似嘅法律保障，反对者就认为同性关系合法化系对婚姻制度嘅重大威胁。帕克同佢嘅伴侣海西喺埋一齐已经有二十几年。并领养两个细路仔抚养成人，佢希望有一日佢哋两人嘅关系能够合法化。目前全美有五个州通过同性婚姻法，有四十二个州全面禁止，其中亦包括德州。帕克知道要令到同性恋获得主流社会嘅认同，仲有一条漫长嘅路要走。但系佢今日唔系一个维权人士，而系一个市长。佢目前应该做嘅就系做一名全民市长。记者徐仲伟，休斯顿报道。多谢收睇美国今制作嘅《美国专讯》，我任敬阳，下次嘅节目时间再见。